YouTube. This is Brother Dennis. Today I give God all the glory. I got my bands. 2024 bands are yellow. I got 40 for right now. Just thinking about joining another club um, that's closer to my house as like a something to do you know i'm disabled so i don't work a lot of free time so uh i'm upgrading my clock this year to an m2 so just to club secretary at this other club marty at the uh fayetteville combine or fayetteville club so that i could race two two clubs even on the same day so with the same clock so um I think I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna get 20 bands from them. Use these 40 and then if I need the other 20, whatever. Or I'll band maybe 30 and 10, something. I don't know, I'll figure it out, but. Every day above, every day when you're above ground is a good day, it's a blessing. But let's face it, all of us have good days and bad days. And today's just, I've had some bad days. When, when you have mental issues, it affects all aspects of your life. You gotta, you, 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 you just, uh, um, so I was in a car accident four years ago, which left me physically disabled. I couldn't return to the job that I had, which was a, you know, crane, I was a crane operator. Um, I can still run the crane, no problem. But the physical demands of being on my feet, walking and- Head east on US-1 North, US-15 North toward US-1 North. As a worker. Continue on US-1 North for 40 miles. It was like the old days when you could just sit on the crane and run it. But down here and in most markets, the operator has to be a laborer too. And I physically can't do it and I, I think that's really the, the I, I tried to go back to work this summer and I, I failed physically. And I'm having a hard time, I'm 54, so I'm having a hard time mentally dealing with that. I originally started this YouTube channel as a form of therapy. Um, and you know, I started showing my, I got some fish as a form of therapy and I always had dogs and uh, but uh, I was down and out a few years ago like mentally I was just defeated I felt defeated close to defeation defeated um, and I was sitting at home on the couch and I started watching a YouTube video and a guy that was a big YouTuber who's got cancer now, his name's Brian Barczyk. Um He made a video one day, he was the happiest guy, it seemed like he was living his dream, and he made a video one day about how he suffered from PTSD and anxiety and depression, and how he, you know, YouTube was helping him. Like, watching that video, like, sparked something in me to help me. And since then, but since then, I'm not gonna give all the credit to YouTube, but you know, I've been progressing in a positive way with my spirituality, with God strengthening me, my family. I say, I have to say this. Some days you just have bad days. Some days you string bad days together, but you have to keep fighting and this last week or two is, the, I just had to keep, I have to keep fighting. Um, you end up pushing your family members away. You end up isolated, not wanting to get out of bed. And you have to have purpose. And YouTube, my family, I, well, I said it in the wrong order. My family gives me purpose. But sometimes that's not, it sounds weird, but sometimes that's not enough because your family, like all my kids are grown. They're living their own lives. 
my, my last son just moved out. So it's just me and my wife at home now. And they're living their life. And it's, I believe I've always had anxiety and depression deep down inside me. And it's my kids and my family that kept it away. And now that they're not here no more, my wife is, but I mean, my, I don't need like, my family gave me purpose. Work every day, feed my kids, close my kids, raise my kids. That was my purpose. That purpose no longer exists. I don't work anymore, I'm disabled, officially disabled. And it's mentally challenging. Why am I making this video? Because today's a bad day. And I don't even know if I'll post this video, but it's the New Year's. It's always the holidays are always the roughest. When you got mental, when you, you know, when you're struggling, holidays are always the roughest to get through. Everybody asks me what's the best thing about Christmas, and I tell them the day after because it's over right so it's like I I feel like I'm pushing myself into a box where I'm the only person in the box it's hard you know finding purpose if you have mental illness or mental health issues, you have to find purpose. You know, when Madis Loft, he always says it in his videos, flying with purpose. I'm flying my birds with purpose. I fly my birds for PTD, PTSD awareness. I fly, that's why I started this channel for PTD, P, PTSD awareness, mental health awareness. Be aware of people around you. You might not have mental health issues, but be know what it looks like. You know, you start seeing people isolating themselves, having a trauma, getting out of bed, laying around, tired all the time. Yeah, that's not tired, that's depression. I'm always telling them, oh, I'm tired, I'm gonna take a nap. No, I'm, it's really depression, what it is. It just give me purpose. My wife, you know, bless her heart, man. She's she's just ill-equipped. She's not a therapist. None of us are, right? She's not a therapist. And I love my wife to death, but sometimes I just I'm hard to deal with. And I, I know that. And I love her for loving me. I love her for her. I would also I love her for loving being able to be loving towards me. That's what you have to do. You have to stand in there when you take them shots. It's not easy dealing with somebody like me. It's not. You know, I, I, my sense of humor is all messed up. I make jokes at the wrong time. I just, mental health is, but you too. You, I started this channel for days like today. Therapists ain't around. I'm on a drive, drove down here an hour and a half. The reason why I drove down here to get my bands today is I needed to drive. I needed to, I needed it, I just needed it. That sounds weird, right? But I just needed to get out, get a, have a purpose for today, a, a reason to get out of bed, a reason to put my shoes on, a reason to, purpose, right? Fly with a purpose. I try to live my life with purpose now, and it's when your kids are grown, I got grandkids, but all of them are well taken care of. You have to live your life with purpose. You have to have purpose in your life, and if you struggle with PTSD, find a purpose, a reason to get out of bed every day. Get out of bed every day. Get up. If God blesses you, if God wakes you up, then you have to do your job. You get out of that bed and do whatever you can to glorify Him 
for giving you breath in your body. It's not your life to take. You didn't give yourself life. But unfortunately, people take their own lives. And you can't even be honest. You can't even say, like I would never say, I've thought about taking my own life, even though I have thoughts along those lines. More or less, what is my purpose of life? Why am I alive? Why, you know, not, I'm gonna shoot, you know, but if you even acknowledge that, yeah, I'm human, they wanna lock you away, medicine aid, medicine you, and all that stuff. That medicine helps some people, but it's not for everybody. I've tried it. Purpose is, purpose. This video, if I post it, it's not for everybody, I know that. But if it, it helps one person, it was worth me posting it. If one person out there with a pistol in their mouth or, you know, ready to jump off the bridge, one person having those thoughts, know that you are loved. And it's not worth it. You can't just respawn. Once you do it, it's done. It's, it's over. Get a get purpose in your life before it comes to that. Get purpose. Get dogs depend on me. My birds, they depend on me to feed them. My chickens depend on me. That's my purpose, my fish. Yeah, and sometimes you make mistakes. Sometimes you let them down. I had two dogs die this summer of heat stroke. They were pets, they were family members. They wasn't investments and in business decisions. I love those dogs. My wife loved those dogs, my son loved those dogs. And I know for a fact, if I didn't have mental health issues, that would never happen. Sometimes you put the cart before the horse. And uh, I, you know, I, Truth of the matter is, I spent a lot of money on a shed, hooking the electric up, doing a bunch of things. My finances was getting low. I said, well, I'll wait till next year, which is 2024 spring, and use a, hook the mini split up in, the, in, the, in my kennel. But right now, I'm just gonna use an air conditioner, brand new air conditioner that was overrated for the space. I had like a 10 by 16 kennel and I had 10,000 BTUs in there, which only needed like five, 55. So the air conditioner wasn't overworked, it wasn't undersized, it just quit. And my two bulldogs died. Be aware. PTSD awareness is just that. A lot of people are walking around here unaware that their loved ones have mental issues, mental health issues, struggling with depression, anxiety. These are these are emotions that we're not, we don't deal with well, why? Because we're not created to have those emotions. Those are the emotions that we get from this fallen world. Humans, they're, they're made to love each other made to have prosperous lives and when things don't go right and you know they don't go right you start developing anxiety you start self-loathing depression you gotta have purpose God woke me up today and I found a purpose. I went and got my rings today. And I can feed, get home, I can feed my chickens and my pigeons and let my dogs run around. 
find a purpose to make it through to, to today. I make it through today, then that's what? Tomorrow is tomorrow. I don't have to worry about tomorrow because today is the day I got to make it through. And then if God wakes me up tomorrow, then I'll have to find a purpose for tomorrow. I love each and every one of you that watch my channel. I'm over 600 subscribers now. And yeah, it's, it's been a while, but I, I want to build something real, you know? I don't want a flash in the pan channel. This is a real life channel. I've been thinking about taking Kennel and Loft off my name because I know a lot of people. That's why when I first started my channel, it was high anxiety. Actually, it was high anxiety bullies and balls. The reason behind that is because I, I always wanted to get into the ball python hobby. I always loved my dogs, my bullies. So I was gonna. That was gonna be my uh, my niche to start my channel. But high anxiety was in the title because I suffer from anxiety. I wanted to bring awareness to it. But then I started, felt like my channel started growing. I felt like I was glorifying it. And I don't want to glorify anxiety. It's nothing to glorify. God needs all the glory. Life itself. You need to glorify that. And anxiety is a negative. So, a new beginning. Every day is a new beginning. New beginning. Every day, you got to look at it as every day is a new beginning. This year, a couple days, new beginning. But right? You don't have to wait till New Year's to make a new beginning. Every day, every day that happens, every hour, every minute, you can make that change. What change is that? You got to ask yourself that. Is it come to God moment? Get a purpose? Whatever. Whatever your change. My change was... My, my new beginning was I moved to North Carolina. I, I just made a new beginning. I started making new changes in my life. And yeah, I put the kennel and loft on there because a lot of people watching my channel for the dogs. A lot of people watching my channel for the pigeons. Nobody really... Well, they probably are, but they're quiet because that's just the nature of it. But a lot of people might not be watching it for the PTSD awareness or... You know, that's why I, in my descriptions, I put PTD, PPST awareness, you know, obesity, physical disability, the things that I'm dealing with, things that I struggle with, things that I need to find purpose with. Live life with a purpose. If you don't have any pigeons, find your purpose. We're here for a reason. There's a purpose in your life you have to find your purpose right and as being a believer i believe that the closer i get to god my purpose in life will be revealed to me but not from the grave not from giving up not from being defeated we're guaranteed a victory we accept defeat you know that's our thing you cannot accept defeat you got to keep fighting that's why my channel's named New Beginning. Every day is a new beginning. If God wakes you up, then you owe it to Him to fight and live your life with a purpose. I want to morph my channel into just my channel. Yes, my pigeons give me purpose. My dogs give me purpose. My family gives me purpose. Right? I'm giving you purpose. Help. Help. Bring awareness to mental health issues. Be mindful of your surroundings. People around you. Your circle. Don't wait till you get to a funeral and be like, I, 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 why? You, when, you, when you know the answer, you could have made a difference in somebody's life. How? Be kind to people. You see somebody in the grocery store 
and their face is all frowned up or whatever. Don't it still speak. Hi, ah, how you doing today? Have a good day. Just talk. Like you never know. A moment of kindness could go a long way in somebody's life. Love one another. There's people out here that really need purpose and encouragement. It's not easy being greasy. And it's not easy living with mental mental. Just think about that. The one thing, your mind so powerful and when it betrays you or tries to let you down or sabotage you it's been damaged or compromised you can't trust your own self imagine that I live that I live with that Sometimes you push people away because you don't want to hurt people that you love, but pushing them away hurts them. It's a slippery slope. I'm no therapist. I'm just telling you what I'm dealing with. Reach out, get help. I've had a therapist. I moved to Maryland. My insurance, I moved to North Carolina. My insurance has changed. So I have to get a new therapist. Uh, I'm trying to get one now. Just don't let anybody pop you. Just keep popping you with pills and not work on getting better. Gotta work on. So I'm talking to the camera right now. I don't know if I'm even gonna post this video. It's getting kinda long. I probably will post it just because I wanna reach somebody. It's the whole purpose of this channel. Yeah. I, I like the pigeons and the dogs and all that stuff, but reaching and helping people was the whole goal because it's a YouTube channel. It was somebody reached out and grabbed me. Ryan Barczyk. And unfortunately, he's got bigger problems now with prostate cancer, like terminal cancer. But he still lives his life with purpose. Still fight. And that's what we got to do up until the end, up until God, until your, your body no longer has life in it. But that's God's plan. Don't give up on yourself. Because you, you could give up today, accept defeat today, and tomorrow could be the day that you had your breakthrough. You could wake up tomorrow. I have no worries. I'm praying for everybody out there. Get in the comments if you want to talk. Ask any questions about how I deal with what I deal with. If this video reaches you, touches you, helped you, let me know. Let me know that I've that I've made a difference and that'll help me with my purpose. My purpose is to make a difference, to help people because I've been on the edge. I've been there with the pistol in my mouth. I've been ready to go. I've been ready to accept defeat.